Just Ryan Matush. Welcome back and good evening, everyone. A very warm and pleasant evening ahead of us. Overnight lows in the upper 60s, lower 70s for some spots. Plenty of sunshine throughout the next several days. We will be remaining calm and quiet, though. That's going to be the theme for quite some time. And then beyond that, we are tracking even warmer temperatures by midweek. I don't want to give too much away, but we might have to talk about triple digits. Outside, satellite and radar picking up on the remainder of those clouds moving through much of the I-70 corridor, exiting through the southeastern portion of the viewing area. They did manage to lower some of our afternoon highs today, but largely we just saw a 90s across the board. If you're missing the rain and thunderstorms like myself, we have to head to the northeast. They've got a pretty well-defined low pressure system spinning near the New York area. I'm missing it. The rain's been gone for quite some time, and the reason being is our upper air patterns. Very important for guiding major changes in our weather uh, systems, but we're just not seeing a whole lot of change. And that's because we have this very dominating high pressure system located over much of the central plains and notice how we're not seeing any radar returns. We're not seeing any rain uh, through the Dakotas, Nebraska, Kansas, Oklahoma. It's just all very dry right now. And that's been the case for quite some time. Outside our Lawrence cam, we are seeing a few little clouds move through the area. That's helped out Matt a little bit on his walk, but I hear it didn't help out a whole lot. Still 90s across the region. Outside our West Topeka cam, a few clouds hanging out in the area, but largely, once again, sunshine dominating the forecast today. And that's going to be the case for the next several days as well. Typically, this time of year, we see an average high of about 86 degrees. We were warmer, that, warmer than that today, lower to middle 90s for much of the region. Uh, the record of 100 degrees set back in 19. 36 didn't hit that today, but we might hit that by Wednesday or Thursday this week. Right now, temperatures 88 degrees feels like 92 though. That's because of the moisture in the area bumping up that heat index just a little bit. By tomorrow morning, we're watching lower 70s across the viewing area. Some spots waking up into the upper 60s. No matter what, it's going to be a nice start to the day. By the afternoon, Tuesday, 1230 for us, we're watching lower to middle 90s and then moving forward just a little bit. Several of us will be in the middle to upper 90s. So another nice day in the forecast. Plenty of sunshine for us. By Wednesday morning, 70s once again, and then the afternoon we're going to be treated to upper 90s for the majority of the viewing area, and it's just going to continue to get warmer at least through Thursday. As far as our comfort cast goes, take a look at this dry and comfortable for the next couple of days, but as those dew points reach the 60s and middle 60s, it's going to start to feel a little bit more humid, and that kind of muggy feeling is going to be coming back by midweek. As far as future track goes, there's those clouds leaving the area, mostly clear skies tonight, waking up tomorrow, maybe a cloud or two drifting through the area by the afternoon, maybe a small little disturbance as well. These little disturbances, though, not doing a whole whole lot. It's just going to be mostly sunny for the next couple of days, taking us all the way through Wednesday morning. Maybe a quick shower here or there, but these signals are rather weak, so we're really just planning on mostly sunny skies. Tonight and tomorrow, we're watching 67 for our overnight lows. Tomorrow, middle 90s, another hot day in the forecast. Once again, a few clouds here and there, nothing to be too worried about. Our forecast for the rest of the week, keeping an eye on 90s for quite some time. And there's that warming trend taking us through at least Thursday. 100 degrees, it's right there just glaring at us. And then by Friday and Saturday, we might have a small chance for some thunderstorms. And then 80s for Sunday and Monday. Yeah, that storm is uh, much welcomed. I know. We've been missing it for so long, so I was happy to put that in. A little yeah. less happy to be talking about the triple digits. Yes, so I'm just looking ahead to that 89 because that's going to feel really good. The 100's <laughs> not even going to happen. We don't have to talk about it. Yeah, just skip on over that. Perfect.